Today, we'll install the USB extended ROM on our Moto G5 Plus. Your phone should be rooted with TWRP recovery installed to do this. Click the link in the top right corner or in the description section to see how you can root your Moto G5 Plus. After you have rooted your phone, there are three files that we need. First, we need the USB extended ROM file. Make sure you download the latest one. Then we need the G apps for Google services. Select ARMS platform 7.1 as Android version and Pico as variant. Lastly, we need the Super SU file. After this process, all your apps will be deleted. Your data might also get deleted in the process. Make sure you have a backup of everything on your phone. Now first, power off your device. Then press the volume down in the power key together to boot into the bootloader mode. Once inside the bootloader mode, press the volume down key twice and hit the power key. Now you will see the TWRP start screen. Connect your mobile to your computer and transfer all the three files we downloaded earlier. Once the transfer is complete, you can remove the USB cable as the computer part is now over. On your mobile, click on the wipe button and swipe the slider to factory reset your phone. Now go back to the TWRP start screen and click on install. Now select the USB extended ROM file and click on it and then swipe to confirm flashing the zip file. Once the process completes, go back and click the OpenGApps file, then swipe to confirm flashing. After installation of GApps, go back and install the SuperSU file. After the process completes, click on Reboot System and then click on Do Not Install. If you hit the bootloader unlocked warning, click on the information icon in the top right to see how you can remove that. If your phone restarts automatically or takes a little longer to start, don't turn it off. The phone takes a little more time than normal to boot when starting for the first time. Don't turn off or restart your phone. So this is the USB extended boot animation. After the phone starts, set it up as a brand new device. After the setup is complete, go to the Play Store and install an app called Root Checker. After installation, open the app. Now click on Agree, then Get Started and then click on Verify Root. Now grant the super user request it asks for. So as you can see, the root access is also working fine on our AOSP extended ROM. We'll soon be reviewing the AOSP extended ROM on the Moto G5 Plus. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.